Hey, what's up, everybody, man? I want to say something, bro. I see a lot of people wondering, Hey, Elvis, it's Corona season. Why are you not bothered? Why are you not scared? Why are you not none of that? Because, because I'm a prophet. Why are you not like this spouse is running? You would die if you catch Corona. I'm not going to catch it, bro. See, I have a sale on me. That that virus will pass me by. Just like in the time of Moses and the Israelites, where they put a mark on their wall, I have a heavenly mark on me. But like, but like I tell you, that, that sickness is of God. So it's not going to touch the true man of God, the true people of God that help me. We know, like, bro, you could say you helped me or you want to. We know who helped, who did everything. Because we were watching. I was watching the whole time. I'm the angel of time. I know who did what and who did not. And I gave my seal to protect them from the virus. Do you understand me? So, I'm not like this pal. See, see, bro, why I'm not scared because I'm not false, bro. See, if I was a false man of God, then I'll be scared because I know God is out to kill me. You feel me? God is out to kill these people. He's kill y'all and this false man of God and the devil and the Illuminati and your country and your president and your warriors and your soldiers and your army and your police officers and your governors from your president to the homeless from the rich to the poor, from the young to the old, he's out to kill all of you. But people wonder why am I good? Because I am a true prophet. See, true prophet don't have to worry about nothing. See, but if this was a regular place, it is a thing. Like, but let me expose this pastors one more time. Like, yeah, put y'all on game. If this was any regular play, like any. Epidemic, not a pandemic, but epidemic, something small, you know what I'm saying, something off this world, this pastor would have been able to cure, they would have been the first one to say, oh, we have a cure in the name of Jesus, but because this plague is sent by God, see, that's how you know it's sent by God, you feel me, when, when pastors are running away from it, when these pastors that do miracles, They've been healing people for years. They've been performing signs and wonders for years. They're running from it. Because a true, because you got to understand one thing about a true man of God, you can heal any disease, no matter what or how deadly the disease is. You feel me? You can heal any disease. There's one thing about a true man of God. Do you understand me? A true man of God can heal any disease. Just like Emmanuel, you know what I'm saying? Who y'all claim, who these false men of God, they change the name and they call it Jesus so they'll do their power, their false powers. You feel me? Like, bro, they did that so they do their false powers. You feel me? Just like Emmanuel, when he came, he healed all manner of sicknesses. And he said, if you are of my disciple, it is in the Bible in Matthew, if you are my disciple, the same thing I do, you would do ten times more. Do you understand? If he could heal all diseases, why can't they? They say, okay, now let's put it this way. They claim that Jesus is the Messiah. What was the one that came thousands of years ago and we, you feel me and they would die that was crucified and resurrected they say that Jesus is the Messiah that was crucified and resurrected okay if they Jesus is the true Messiah didn't they Jesus tell these false prophets that you can heal all manner of sicknesses so why can't they heal this sickness mm, 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 mm. so you haven't thought about it like this right so you never thought about it like this Okay, before this disease came, right, they were bragging, they raised, okay, let me ask you, if you can raise the dead, oh yeah, oh yeah, better fact, America, 
America, this is the perfect chance for y'all to call on those pastors that said they could raise the dead. Oh, remember, bro, 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 remember before all this epidemic pandemic started, these motherfuckers were raising the dead nigga, dead nigga and everything. Like, 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 bro, if they say it's a fucking lie, nigga, I will show you, bro. Y'all, bro, bro, y'all false ass man of God said you raised the dead, bro. Bro, y'all false ass nigga said y'all could raise the dead, bro. Oh, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Let me find it real quick. Bro, let me find the video. Bro, let me find the video. <laughs> Now let me find the video. Hold on. Oh, hold on. Oh, hold on. Let me find the video. Yeah. It's like African Pastor Resurrection. Okay, let's see. Yes. Perfect. Hey, can y'all see this? Yeah, can y'all see this? You see this, right? You see what I was telling you, right? Now this shit made sense. You see this, right? They raise the dead, but they can't raise none of y'all niggas that die from coronavirus, though. What is his name? Jesus. Jesus. You see them, right? That's them. <laughs> look, at, look at them. Look at them. Look at them. Look at them. Elliot. Yeah, look at them. Elliot. Yeah, they about to raise him from the dead now. In the name Elliot. of Jesus. The devil said they're going to raise him from the dead in the name of Jesus, though. Look at him. Look at him. Look at him. Look now. Look now. That's them. That's them, though. So that's them, though. That's a false miracle, though. See, that's what they were doing, like, before the coronavirus started. You see? You see the false miracle they were doing? Why they? Oh, why they? And they name of Jesus, the name of Jesus, though. This is how they were doing that false name. <laughs> so you see that? You see that the money power? See? You see this? See? You see he's commanding life. You see that? You see that? It's, you see that? You see that? They raised it. You see that? No, 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 but you see that? You see that? Jesus is a You see? Okay, that's all. All right. Now. <laughs> they got. It. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. But what I'm about to say. It's going to sound like I don't give a fuck, but it's the truth. Do you understand? You you now have 17,000 people dead. <laughs> you have 70,000 people who died from coronavirus. This is the best time world leaders, kings, presidents, governors, rulers. <laughs> oh... Every rule of the seven continents, every president, every king, every ruler of the seven continents, every government, this is the perfect time to make this false man of God show their reservation power that they fucking swore they had before this coronavirus started. This is the perfect time. Tell them to raise them back from the dead. They can't. They will not be able to. Because what? They're false. Because the Bible said, whatever I do, you shall do more upon it. And they might be like, it's a lot. Hold up. Let me see if I can find it. Hold on, let me see what I'm crying. 
and was affirmed by God through signs and wonders and various miracles and gifts of the Holy Spirit distributed according to his will. For it is not to angels, yet subject the world to come. See, it said, Acts 14, verse 3. So Paul, Acts 14, verse 3. So Paul and Barnabas spent considerable time there speaking boldly for the Lord and who affirmed the message of his grace by enabling them to perform signs and wonders. See, that's Acts 14. Film, Acts 14 verse 3. So you were able to perform signs and wonders and sickness from the heart. That's why he said, I've given you authority to trample on snakes and scorpions and to overcome all the powers of the enemy. Yes, the enemy say nothing. Nothing shall harm you. Nothing will harm you. Do you see that? The favorite song. I've given you authority to trample on snakes and scorpions and to overcome all the powers of the enemy. Who's the enemy? Therefore, nothing, nothing shall harm you. Nothing shall harm you. Do you see? I'm a real man of God. Nothing's going to harm me. They false. That's why they scared. <laughs> it's funny, bro, watching y'all panic. Look at Mr. Como. Look at him panicking. <laughs> Look at them panicking. <laughs> Look at all of them panicking. <laughs> I told them this day would come. They laughed at me and said, oh, you stupid. Jesus will save us. <laughs> ah, Y'all niggas went on Jesus. <laughs> they told me Jesus would save them. <laughs> now they went on Jesus to save them. <laughs> Let's see how long it's going to take for your Jesus to save you. <laughs> oh, man. Let's see how long it's going to take. But that would be the topic of this day. I got them thing. How long will it take for Jesus to save the world? <laughs> <laughs> oh, man. The jungle screen. It's funny, bro. Because y'all said all that shit about Jesus. And now <laughs> that nigga is nowhere to be found. <laughs> Yo, Jesus. Even this false man of God that been doing all these miracles and all these signs and wonders. These niggas are nowhere to be found. <laughs> yeah, bro. These niggas are nowhere, bro. Like, bro, you cannot find the niggas. Like, these niggas hiding from y'all. <laughs> they know nowhere to be found. These niggas raise the dead. <laughs> these niggas know nowhere to be found to raise the people to come and raise 17,000 dead people. <laughs> these niggas are funny. <laughs> they know they can't even go close to the dead people. They will contact the virus and they will die. <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm sorry, bro. I'm sorry. Bro, bro, but look, bro, I'm not laughing at y'all. Like, I've, I've, I've laughed at y'all, no. But, but, like, what I'm laughing at is just all this shit y'all said. Like, you had so much faith in these people. You were talking shit with them people talking about Jesus will save us. <laughs> now, where's your Jesus to save you? <laughs> even the false man of God you put hope in, did me evil for even your pastor. Don't even want you. <laughs> that nigga don't even want you near him. He don't even want you. <laughs> He only wanted to, hey, and before this shit happened, he used to be like, call and pray for you. Yeah, he'll hug you, do all this, he only want to hug you no more. <laughs> <He's> like, <laughs> it's funny, it's bro. <laughs> Y'all don't get the joke. <laughs> only true man of God will get the joke. <laughs> this shit is funny. <laughs> hey, you better stop believing those false men of God. There is no Jesus. Jesus is not coming, I promise you. You're going to wait forever. <laughs> But let's watch and see if Jesus will come and save y'all. <laughs>